Hey folks, Coach here with Village Breaks. Got home from work today, after a long hard day. Walked to the dog, checked the mailbox. Boom! Package from Mr. DV, the man, the myth, the legend. I have no idea what's in this, but knowing DV, and after watching his videos, and the absolute fire that he tends to pull, I feel as though that I should call 911 and tell them to be on standby and handle this package with oven mitts. So we're going to take our chances. Now I did pre-cut the tape because you put enough tape on there to ship the Hope Diamond safely. Because he knows that I'm old and tape confuses me. Ooh, this is fancy. We've got a bag. Man, that is a brick. What in the world? Nice! <laughs> oh, DV, you are too much. Too much, my friend, because I see what's on the bottom there. I mean, it's kind of, we'll start here. It's giving me a chance. It's all I need is a chance. I've seen him pull one. I've seen Triple B pull two. I just need a chance. So we're going to hope that that's got a bat down in it. We've got a new signature card, the 2020 edition. So we're definitely going to have to put that back there. Aha! I see a home run challenge card. We'll definitely be scratching that one. And DV, I see your home run challenge and I raise you a Max Kepler that'll be coming your way. Nice. Chipper Jones, 85 throwback. Very cool card. Nice Acuna Future Stars. Kobe Allard, who is having a great spring for the Rangers, but still, good pitcher. Kyle Wright, I do not have that one. That's awesome. Soroka. Ah, Luis Urias. Hopefully he does well with the Brewers. Ooh, shiny. Nice Prism Kopech season ticket from Contenders here. Contenders Optic. That's a nice one. A Riley from Classics. Him and Camargo, you can tell they're competing because they are going, they're going at it in spring training. They're probably the two hottest Braves right now um, playing. Ooh, Eloy. Very nice. I uh, also do not think that I have this one, so that is awesome. Straight into the PC. Kobe White, he is a Tar Heel. And he's from North Carolina to boot. So not only does he play, did he play for the best college team in the country? Just not this year. Um, he's also from uh, North Carolina. Nice Eloy Jimenez certified rookie. It's got some rainbow shine. And an Eloy Bowman. I know I do not have this one. That is awesome. Is that a variation? I'm not sure. I haven't. Hmm. I'll have to look that one up. That is really cool. All right, I see a Sir Mr. Acuna here on the outside. So, I like the way this is starting here. Ah, nice. Acuna from Chronicles. I do not have that one. And I do not have that one. Nice. And I think I might have just gotten Kikuchi bombed. Yes, yes, I did. I, I have gotten a Kikuchi bombed. Yeah, very nice, DV. Very nice. Guess what? Guess what? You haven't seen the size of my Kikuchi collection. That's hard to say. But uh, you'll know the size of that collection pretty soon. Nice Atlanta Braves. Let's hope that the 2021 Atlanta Braves card has them hoisting a trophy as well. Two of the greatest young players in baseball. Love that. Nice. A couple of chipper Hall of Fame cards here that I do not have. I've got a few out of this set, but I would like to try to put that whole set together. That is cool. Nice. He just got hired by ESPN as an analyst. I don't know why. I don't know how Fox let him go or let him slide by. I wish that Fox would have hired him on so he could have called nothing but Braves games. Another Kikuchi. DV. DV. That's all I'm saying is, is DV. Nice Acuna. Optic. Now this 
telling you right now, watch this dude. I think he went three for three yesterday. I didn't see what he did today. But uh, tearing it up. Christian Pache. And that's from those uh, Bowman Mega Boxes that DV prints in his basement. Hopefully he's got that print and press tuned in and ready to go. Ozzy Albies, 83 throwback rookie. Very nice. And this, is this a short print? I think it might be. I have not seen that one. He was probably getting ready to give someone a bro hug, but that's awesome. Man, and there's more. Jeez. Come on now, DV. I mean, I know that I sent you Kent Herbeck, and he's been hanging around your house uh, cleaning the, and doing the laundry and stuff, but gosh. We have Austin Riley Mojo. On the depth chart, Austin Riley is listed as the backup first baseman, which with Freddie's elbow issues, he might actually make the team. Now that is ridiculous. That is absolutely beautiful card. Man, rookie debut out of 150 out of Chrome. That, oh, that blue, oh, it looks so good. That's a nice card. And then an Acuna rookie. Look at that. Out of select. Man. Do not have that one. I will add it to my Acuna rookies. That is fantastic. And look at that. That is an auto of Urias. That is nice. And an Acuna first Bowman. I think DV has managed to hit me straight in the PC. And then look at that. Braden Shoemake. Don't sleep on Braden Shoemake. I think he could be potentially a pretty good pretty good player. Dan, uh, Dansby uh, Swanson might want to watch his back there at shortstop. Because Shoemake's going to be coming up. If Dansby doesn't get the bat off his shoulder, Shoemake might take it from him. It's going to be a couple years out, but he was a late first-round pick for the Braves. They took Shea Langlier's. I think at ninth, and he was the um, compensation pick for dude last year who went to college. <laughs> went to college. What a loser. All right. DV, awesome. Now, if this has got a bat down Acuna in it, um, I don't know what I'm going to do. <sighs> All right. Here we go, guys. Courtesy of the man, the myth, the legend, DV. Sandy Alcantara rookie. Ah, Blake Snell. Miguel Montero. Giolito, like that one. Hanniger. We have reached the sideways portions of the show. Jameson Talion. Adam Warren. Desmond. Britton. Carrasco. Judge. It looks like we do have a short print, but it's a Cub. Hank Aaron, and it's an Addison Russell. Pretty sure this is a shorty. Yep. So it's a short print, but just not the short print we were looking for. But, man, still awesome to hit a short print. I'll take it. We got the Judge. And the Hank Aaron. I'll definitely put that in my, my Hank Aaron pile. Bragman, Verlander. Couple of inserts there. Let's see if we got anything else here in the back half of it. Nice Matt Davidson. Pool holes, future Hall of Famer. The punk. Hey, look, I'm an idiot. Let's focus in on how stupid he is. Come on, focus in. There we go. Now you can see the stupidity. Kenta Maeda. I forget where Kenta Maeda went. Jorge Bonifacio and Nicholas Castellanos. So, didn't hit the bat down, but I definitely appreciate the chance, DV. Did hit a really nice Addison Russell short print, though, so that's pretty cool. All right. Got a couple of, uh, I've gotten into vintage breaks lately. I did a, what year was it? 
Did a 62 Tops vintage break, and I'm running these with Burl Sports. And in the 62 Tops, basically, I took the entire set. I think there was 498 cards. So you buy five spots, you get five cards, and they random it out. And whatever you get, you get. Um, I didn't hit any of the big names. I mean, you got some, you got some just straight monsters in 62. But I did hit, let's see here. Chuck Schilling from the Sporting News, Ron Hansen, a rookie of Al Downing, Home Run Leaders, which this was a cool card. It's got uh, Cepeda, Willie Mays, and Frank Robinson on it. Now, the American League version of this card is really coveted because it's the summer of 61. It's Maris and Mantle going after it. So that card is really coveted. This one, the corners look really good on this one. It is off center left to right, but as far as... Um, as far as the corners, I might actually send this one in and just see what it comes out. And then the best card I probably pulled was this one. And you look at it and you're like, okay, no real big names on this. Yeah, it's a rookie parade. It is graded. But what you got to look at on this one is it's a high number. And the high numbers were really short printed. So even though not a whole lot of big names on here, just the fact that it's hard to get makes it a little more valuable um i've been seeing ungraded uh unslabbed ones going 30 to 40 on ebay so not not a bad card at all uh was it saturday or sunday i don't know i'm not sure what day it is anymore i got into a 1958 set break with burls and i missed the hank aaron by one spot I think it was card number 30, and I got 31, or vice versa. But I did hit a nice, I'm probably saying the name wrong, Bill Mazeroski, Mazeroski, I'm not sure. Hit a nice one of those. Uh, it's his second year card. It's not his rookie, but still a nice second year. Probably the best one I got out of that break. And he's going to have a 55 Bowman coming up pretty soon. He does pre-war, uh, which is World War II, pre-war mixers. Um, he gave away a couple of 33 Gaudis. Uh, I think one of them was the Babe Ruth. So he, he does all kinds of really cool mixers. So if you get a chance, check him out. It's Burl, and that's B-U-R-L-S, Burl's Sports. Uh, just Google that. It'll take you to his site, and you can see all his pass breaks. Um, having fun with that, though. Kind of getting into vintage a little bit. But DV, thank you again. Amazing package. Um, these Kikuchis, I just can't thank you enough. The Kikuchis are going to go straight into my Kikuchi PC that I'll be sending you as well. Um, my Kikuchi PC probably numbers in the hundreds right now. So there's going to be a Kikuchi bomb coming your way. This is Coach of Village Breaks. You guys take care. And if you happen to see DV um, and you want to give him any Kikuchis, it's his favorite player. So feel free to mail him all the Kikuchis you have. You guys take care.